So you guys, I just returned from work and we're about to leave to go to the festival, what I was talking about in Antwerp. I'm going to show you around, I'm going to show you what's there. What I'm wearing is this sweater with just black jeans and my Nikes. These are more comfortable. In the beginning, I hated them because they like hurted my, my foot and it was terrible, but we're going out and it's actually a beautiful weather, but it's very windy, so yeah. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> that was such a fail. The place that we're going to is like this festival where you have to pay income around nine euro and the thing that you can do there is like eat these very tiny dishes either made by professional cooks or anything but it's just fun um, it's quite expensive they told us because it's like around five to seven euro for a very small and tiny portion um, but still like you have to enjoy the small things in life like I don't even care I just want food I just want to enjoy myself I just want to have fun and look at this tiny guy like making these tiny gestures anyways um we're going to meet up with some family um my brother and girlfriend and then my and then my grandmother is coming with us um i'll see you guys in a bit bye guys look at this building though i look so impressive and this like extra playground he actually really wanted to play with this <laughs> Is it <laughs> Whether you can hear me or not, because it's so windy here, I'm so sorry. But this department of the city is actually really, really big. This department is actually newly renovated, which means that all of these buildings are completely new. They have like a view on um, the water and beautiful boats. So. We are now about to like look where where do we have to go? Where do we have to go? Where do we have to go? To the right side. Oh, okay. This is the first time that I've been here before and it looks like they're actually still working here because of the construction sites. Like you see them pretty much everywhere. We arrived at the Vajnasi. And here are a lot of events and expositions, so if you're trying to actually like look for anything to do here, a lot of events are here, so um, just look on their website.
well. So I'm pretty surprised that they have that here. I still look quite fine, so I'm happy. I don't know why, but I love how aesthetically this looks. I mean, it has a very jungle feeling to it, and modern, and 
if I could, I would have been at home. good the quality of the food was very good um, it were like star quality dishes and they tried to do something different with it they tried to combine many different tastes which I loved about it but it was quite expensive for what we got and what we actually had um, I'm sorry that it's actually like not light here but I'm like currently in the dark and there are no lights here but I had so much fun though I I'm tired there were so many things that you could do there um, there were cooking things for kids, there were some things for kids which I love about it, that they do not only think about the adults. There were many occasions to drink something, there were many occasions to eat something, I mean, generally, it was like very amazing. I, I thought it was very fun, um, I had a great time, but now I'm pretty tired. I am very glad that I took that aspirin because... I, I, my headache is completely gone, so I can I can still go for a minute. Um, and my dad is going to get some fries now, yeah, so yeah, yeah. let's see how that is going to be, because he did not eat anything at all. I don't know why, but he's always so generous. He wants us to have everything, but he always like puts himself on the background, which I, which is totally not what I want, because I want him to enjoy it as well. The thing that I love the most is the freshness, because it was like fresh, it was new, it was renewing for me. It tickled my taste buds. It was, yeah, just everything in general was amazing, but too expensive. I have to say too expensive. You guys i'm gonna end my vlog vlog i don't know just watch it through this amazing day if you ever want to go to this um first of all i'll put it in the description below what it's called because i kind of like don't have a working brain at this point <laughs> i hate leaving my bed it's the worst feeling in the world where you know that you have to get up but you're still tired as fuck <sighs> I'm already thankful for everyone that has been following me for the past couple of days. I just want to thank everyone for following me. I was so flabbergasted yesterday. I had six new followers, which is so much. And I want to thank every single one of them because I, I sometimes it just feels like whatever you're doing is for nothing mainly because you don't get any subscribers to your channel and at the same time I think like I do what I love I should not be complaining about it and I just already thank the people that are subscribed to me because I'm really extremely thankful for that I talk too much when I am in my bed just hope you like this day and this vlog it's kind of embarrassing because <laughs> like whenever I was filming the foods there were people standing there and I was like taking my camera out and they were looking at me like why are you freaking filming the food what are you going to do you weirdo but I actually didn't really mind it as much I think I'm getting more and more open thing is with vlogging it's so much more easy if someone is with you or if there are more people with you that um, do exactly the same as you because then it's less embarrassing because 
you're embarrassing together. I thank you guys for watching. I thank you guys for subscribing. I thank you guys for liking. I thank you guys for everything. And uh, I hope to see you soon in my next video. So, <laughs> bye guys. I forgot your name.